Researchers across the world are looking at different ways to treat patients with COVID-19. One of those ways is through something called convalescent plasma therapy. On Friday, the FDA named Mayo Clinic to lead a national COVID-19 plasma program. The FDA believes through this effort, they'll be able to move thousands of units of plasma to patients who need it in the coming weeks. We're looking to enroll, you know, a thousand people or more. If we get ramped up quickly, uh, it could go on for some time and, and, and that scope could expand. Dr. Michael Joyner at Mayo is leading the program. Patients who have recovered from the novel coronavirus that causes COVID-19 have antibodies in their blood that can fight the virus. A donor's plasma can then be transfused into a very sick COVID-19 patient who doesn't have that immunity yet. And for those considered high risk, it could offer some protection against the infection. Not only facilitate getting this treatment to patients, but also collect key data so we can actually try to understand the analytics in real time and then hopefully set the stage for randomized clinical trials down the road. But Mayo Clinic says getting donors is an issue, especially with the lack of testing. The big thing in the next one to two weeks is identifying potential donors, getting those people scheduled to donate, and really getting that ball rolling so that we have a steady supply of this product to treat patients with. So I think that this is gonna be particularly helpful at the end of this wave, and then very helpful in suppressing a second wave if it occurs. Heidi Wigdahl, CARE 11 News. Well, those who've recovered from COVID-19 who want to donate should contact their local provider. We also have much more information on this at care11.com.